Welcome to Boys and Girls. Today we're going to go into a little bit more detail about multiplication. If you remember yesterday in math class, we talked about multiplication a little bit. So I'm going to do a quick review. Can someone tell me what the three main words are that we use in multiplication? Yes. Multiply. Good. Another word that we use. That's it. Product. Good. Product. We have one more. We have one more word. Can someone tell me what it is? When we multiply, we're usually doing what? Double. Good. Those are our three main words. Multiply, product, and double. Can someone tell me what multiply means? When you multiply something, what are you what are you exactly doing when you're multiplying? Yes. Good. When you're multiplying, what you're doing is you're adding if you add any number You're multiplying two by two times two. You're actually doing what? You're adding two to two. When you multiply two times four, is you're adding two to itself four times. So two plus two plus two plus two. Okay. Can someone tell me what product is? Product. You're multiplying with. You're close. Can someone else give me another answer? Try. Yes. Product is the result you get when you multiply. Correct. So basically, product is the answer. The multiplication problem was telling you to find the product, you would be finding an answer. Good. How about when you double something? What does double mean? I need double. Double. Yep. Double means to multiply. Good job. A number by. everyone uh, um, please get out a blue marker crayon or colored pencil and a yellow one as well. That's fine. If you don't have a marker, you can use a crayon. It's fine as long as it's yellow or we, we, we need both a yellow and a blue. Those two colors you're going to need. Can I have a volunteer pass out this worksheet? Thank you. Thank you for volunteering. Boys and girls, um, right now we have Michael passing out a worksheet. And this worksheet is called The 100 Plus. I'm going to go over directions once everyone receives a worksheet. And if you do not have a worksheet, if you could please um, raise your hand and Michael will hit Okay. Does everyone have a worksheet? Okay, great. So what we're going to do with this worksheet is we're going to learn to multiply. Today we're going to learn to multiply by twos and by fives. 
And this chart right here is going to help us learn our multiplication of 2 and 5. So what I need for everyone to do now is to grab their yellow marker pen, marker, crayon, or colored pencil. The yellow. And what you're going to need to do with your yellow crayon, your yellow crayon is for your twos. So you're going to multiply by twos, and you're going to shade those squares yellow. So when you're multiplying by twos, you first begin at two. You're going to count by twos. So you shade the number two yellow. And then you count another two. One, two. This is four. Shade it yellow. One, two. This is six. Shade it yellow. And so forth. So I need everyone to go through their chart and keep counting two squares, shade it yellow. Count two squares, shade it yellow. Till you get to a hundred. Okay? Boys and girls, is everyone done shading their twos, adding by twos, and shading them yellow? Okay, now that means we can move on. I need everyone now to get out a blue. A blue marker, crayon, or colored pencil. And what we're going to do with the blue is we're going to learn to multiply by fives. When we're multiplying by fives, what are we? What are exactly are we going to be doing? Yes, Jennifer. Correct. When you're multiplying by fives, in order for us to know this, we're going to be adding five each time. So, we're going to begin. We're going to add, we're going to count five squares. One, two, three, four, five. So the number five you can shade blue. Now we're going to count another five. One, two, three, four, five. We're at ten. So forth. So you get to the bottom of the chart. I'm going to give you guys another couple minutes to finish up counting your um, counting by fives. Okay, can I have everyone's attention? In your hundreds chart, we have shaded counting by twos the color yellow and shading counting by fives the color blue. Can someone show me and tell me what do we see that is common when we're when we're adding by twos, which means that we're multiplying by twos. What's common? What's so common about the numbers that are shaded yellow? Can someone tell me? Very good. They're all even numbers. When you're multiplying by two, your product should always be an even number. As you can see in the chart, all the shaded yellow boxes are the color yellow, and they are an even number. We don't. You shouldn't have any odd numbers shaded yellow. Very good. And all the numbers end in two, four, six, eight. Those are all even numbers and multiples of 2. What do we see that is common for multiples of 5? The blue squares. What is common about the answers that we have? Yes. Most of them end in 5. Very good. What else? What else do we see that's common? They end in 5s or they end in what? Zeros. Good. So we have 5. 10, 15, 20. So you can notice that the number either ends in a 5 or a 0. Okay? So I need you guys to keep this chart handy because this chart right here helps you find your multiples of 2 and your multiples of 5. 